Uh, Strange Inheritance is back. Uh, new edition, in fact, a White House edition, timely, airing tonight. Jamie Colby, the extraordinary host, joining us right now. You, you, got, you got to tell me what this White House thing is about. Everybody wants a piece of the White House, Neil. Leave it to me to get it. This family from New England had this piece of like wood and plaster in their attic for over 100 years. It went from house to house. They didn't really know what it was. We came in and all of a sudden we learned by having a pain analysis that it's actually a piece of the White House dating back to 1902 that a relative of theirs walked up Pennsylvania Avenue, saw discarded on the lawn. Here it is. It lives in this case now, which is like bulletproof and, and crash proof. It's very delicate. I was a skeptic, Neil. I walked in and I couldn't believe that it really came from the White House after it was destroyed in 1812 and was rebuilt. This was a piece that was in a hall called the Cross Hall. And our paint analyst went through 17 layers of paint and matched every single one of them with, with a uh, White House expert to a different administration. It's the real deal, Neil, and it went up for auction. It's absolutely an incredible piece of history. This is Bill Seal explaining to me and showing me this picture of what's called a plinth in that cross hall. And uh, can you imagine it was once white and then it was red and it was actually solid gold? You have to look at the candidates now and wonder what color would they paint the cross hall? Yeah, and you got to think back. I mean, I'm that's thinking a, gold leaf. I'm thinking that too. Them. That was when Teddy Roosevelt yeah. was president. I guess. Uh, marching on here, but I'm wondering um, how do they verify this stuff? A lot of times when they have valuable stuff, and I know we've done this in prior episodes and shows, we have to verify what this guy has or woman has is of great value and is the real McCoy because you have to s separate the wheat from the chaff, right? Yeah, absolutely. We see a lot of trash before we find treasure, but after having the paint analyst tell us that it clearly was from the appropriate time period and having the White House expert who's written the definitive book on the White House interiors hmm. tell us, Bill Seal, that this is it. It went up for auction at RR Auctions in Boston and you know it was bought by a viewer from Fox that saw a little preliminary piece about it going up for auction and they actually took it home with them wow. and it's now owned and appreciated and that piece of history lives on. I really think people at this point, after doing 50 Strange Inheritance episodes, going out and meeting these families, that people are checking their attics. They are emailing me at jamie at strangeinheritance.com. And I'm loving going out and bringing these new episodes on Monday nights to our viewers at Fox Business. They're it's great stuff. It's great stuff. Watching them. I worry for you as a friend and a colleague when some dude invites you into his basement. I mean, are there precautions that are made? Are there assurances you get? What? <laughs> From you, Neil, that if anything happens, I could call you at a moment's oh. notice and you'll come rescue me. They'll sleep me. with the fishes. They will sleep with the fishes. They are. Well, Jane, I, know I look that. forward to it. We have two episodes it. tonight, Neil. Excellent. I cannot wait. It's fun stuff. It's really, and a lot of people don't realize what's sometimes right in their own home, in their attic or, or, their, or their basement. Just make sure you have company when you join them there.